welcome to lean ft tutorial series again in this tutorial we will see how to define test objects manually in the application model editor you can manually define test objects in the application model this is useful if you want to initiate preparing your testing infrastructure before or while the application is being developed to add the test objects manually launch visual studio and create or open an existing application model project In the application model editor toolbar, click the create new test object button and provide the required details in the new object pane. technology as web and type as edit box you can also optionally provide a detailed description or a screen captured image The code name is the name that you use to reference the object in your test code. You need to remember that you can create the test objects in your application model for any technology object interf interface provided in the LeanFT SDK. When working with web-based applications, your iBrowser or browser test objects must be created in your test code. and pass to application model class instance as a context for the application model. In the identification section, click all which is uh, displayed by default to view the supported properties for the object that you have selected. Mark the checkbox of the properties you want to use to uniquely identify your object. We will use name and tag name. You can view them together in the used view. Now you can enter the relevant values in the properties selected. To enter regular expression values for string properties, click the set as regular expression star to the right of the value box. Specify regular expressions using VBScript regular expression syntax. For example, to indicate any number of characters in a string, use dot star. You need to remember that regular expressions are not supported for mobile test objects. Click the save button at the top of the new object pane. To save your changes and add the new object to the application model. By following this procedure, you can create the test objects manually before the application is being developed. Thank you. The next video in this tutorial series is more features of application model.